Well, I've been thinking about many things involved in this piece for uh, a while, and I've done a couple of iterations of this work, which is kind of a combination of my fascination with the 1968 uh, Mexico Olympics branding package in conjunction with the graphics uh, program of a utopian community in Northern California called the Sea Ranch. And it's really just kind of my desire to see these two loves, in a way, kind of come together in this environment. And maybe a way to experience love is to kind of just get immersed in something. The giant graphic on the floor is very much from the Mexico Olympics. The number columns, the extrusions of, of thread, are really just the zip code of the Sea Ranch. And then there's other little elements thrown in. We always take into account how the viewer is entering the room. I'm not like seeking out something really theatrical so much as something maybe more unexpected. If there's things that overlap and as color relationships might be created through sort of flow, it's, it's really wanting the viewer to look at it more. And opening up the, the viewing audience is, you know, kind of critical, I think. For me, every project is a testing ground and mistakes are welcome. Unexpected surprise, there's always that component to the work. And a lot of the way that we've done these pieces is for Jay Yan to be on-site interfacing. And you know, I'm as involved as I can, <laughs> but I'm always surprised. The expectations are one thing, but what you get can be sometimes so much more.